Hello and welcome back to our Let's Play of Europa Universalis 4. So, last time we played, uh, we were at war with France. Sure. And uh, the French were kicking our asses. We have quite a bit of money, so I can rebuild the army. We have quite a bit of men as well. So I can rebuild the army, but the French are level 18 tech. Level 18 military tech. By comparison, I am, where is it here? I'm level 15 military tech. So, we're quite a bit behind them. I don't think we can win this war. So what do French want? They want that. Um, they can have it. Let's see what they want. Because uh, I'm currently sieging the, one of their core provinces. My navy has been completely destroyed. It stood no chance against the uh, French navy. It was completely destroyed. So I have to rebuild the navy. And I think the next navy is the Galleas and the Brig. We don't get early frigates until level 15. Um, I think I'm going to let them come across the mountains and siege what they want. Just because I have no way of stopping them at the moment. They are kicking my ass quite handily. So let's get some more musketeers. Sure, let them go, I guess. So, we're losing sieges very fast on us because, as you can see, we do not have uh, at least level 2 forts built everywhere. Not even level 3 forts. So, let's get to work on the forts and every province kind of, kind of need them. That's a shame. Look, they're just tearing through. Actually, I think that was my army that just took uh, this region away from them. Alright, so I can't get through here. I'd have to ask English Louisiana. How did they finally get a colony in Eng here? Hmm. I'd have to march through these guys. Unfortunately, my army has been destroyed quite handily. French have a little fleet here. Wow, and it's gone in 20 seconds. What is this little fleet? Looks like frigates. All I have are uh, caravels. No, I don't want you to go there. Let's have all the armies ra <laughs> rally in Panama. France has got two huge armies. And I'll even take this army as well. The the pirate king himself and rally there. Because we need to stop the French incursion quickly. Um, even if I have to throw, you know, 50,000 soldiers at them. Hugh the second de Valois. That's not the king, is it? Is it the French king? I don't know who is. It is. That is the French king. Is in the new world. Decided to fight. Man. 
So, but my tech western is, or my tech is now western. We should be teching up um, pretty soon. To, uh, you know. Enlist privateers. I can also found in a Indian trade company now if I have <laughs> we colonized uh, we colonized Alaska <laughs> pirate Alaska yahar They're CG, but they're not gaining any war score. Oh no, they've seized Bogota. We'll have to stop them somehow. But, on the brighter side, um, I think tomorrow I'm going to start a new Let's Play, a Crusader Kings Let's Play. I was going to do the Witcher uh, Kings, but that, that, it loves to, to lag constantly, like constant lag, and it's really, really annoying. So I don't know what to do about it, honestly. <laughs> so instead, I'll find a, another Crusader Kings 2 mod and we'll play it. Uh, there are a couple of mods that aren't out yet that I'd love to do. Um... It's unfortunate, but they're not out yet, and I'd love to do them. But, uh, we'll look. Maybe I'll do the Winter Kings, uh, which is, um, the Dark Ages. It's kind of centered around, uh, the map is only, like, this part of Europe. Like, just this. Like, what you guys can see right here is the map for it. So, or maybe a little bit lower. Maybe like that. But you got, you know, the Franks and Charlemagne, and you have, you know, the various warring kingdoms of uh, England during the Saxon invasions, and you have what's left of the Roman Gallic, you know, kingdoms. So, you know, I think it'll be a lot of fun. Uh, I plan to start it tomorrow. What, what do you want? What else do you want? So what do they want? They want they want one province and nine hundred dollars that I don't have. Now they want a thousand dollars that I don't have. Fine. Well, that was fun, getting my ass kicked by the French. You know. I've also lost Florida. English Civil War has begun, and they have gone with the Parliamentarians, which are, if you know anything about the English Civil War, they are Parliament and the people against the Crown Loyalists. So they are now, or they're an administrative republic under Stadtholder Oliver Cromwell. I should be a Republican dictatorship. As you can see, we have uh, royalist rebels here. And if, you know, if the royalists win, they'll overthrow Cromwell. But on a side note, Austria has become a huge blob, and 
They're kicking everybody's ass. Holy hell, the Austrians are kicking ass. Good, make sure the French starve to death. Hooray, a colony became self-sustaining. Excellent. Stability cost modifier, definitely. I need diplomatic rep guy. Okay, now let's pay back the loan. There you go. Let's reduce insulation. Reduce it some more. Gotta have a lot of infl inflation. There you go. It's been reduced, so now I'm making uh, like $38,000 or $38. A month. Damn French. Why well, can only ally a great power? England's weak. Austria is probably other. The only other strong great power other than the Ottomans. And they hate me just because I'm a competing great power. Enemies, Russia, Spain, France, Austria, and Persia. Wasn't I allied with the Persians? Maybe I was playing a different game. I was allied with the Persians. Maybe it was another game. I can't remember. Looks like the... People of Thailand have conquered Southeast Asia. I can also see uh, Divet, which is Vietnam. I can see Japan as well. Japan looks like it's united itself and <laughs> it's occupied by Catholic zealots. Oh no. Those Catholics. They don't know when to not give up. Looks like uh, the Inca are going to be conquered by British and Portuguese. I don't know what the hell the French are doing. They're just marching through my country. Well, they've been banished, so it's fine. Everybody's like two military techs higher than me. I can't do anything. I'll be military tech 15 with new pirate troops, but I don't think that'll help. So actually, my diplomatic reputation is actually 15 with this. And then if I got certain idea groups, I think they're diplomatic ideas. Diplomatic reputation. Or is it? Plus three. So it'll only be 11. And then there's another idea somewhere. I forget what idea it is. But you get like another plus five diplomatic rep. Menaced ideas, local traditions, lowest revolt risk. That's probably the best idea they've implemented is humanist ideas. So, like, if you have a huge sprawling empire, it really helps. That way, you don't have to convert as much crap that's just accepted in the country. There it is. New soldiers, pirate charge infantry. I'm probably about as teched up as the Ottomans are. 
No, <laughs> the Ottomans are level fucking 18 military. Oh my god. The Ottoman Empire could defeat me in a war. Oh, they killed my colony. Oh. They done did killed my colony. Probably another two years before they show up again. How am I making money? That doesn't make any sense. Have all these become self-sustaining? Almost. A couple are pretty close. They're level 12 military tech. But hey, at least they have guns. At least they have guns, guys. The Mohegans. I can't believe I lost my uh, my colonies. There we go. Support rebels. Abenaki rebels, 50%. No, you cancel. So discontent. That's so discontent in our country. That's so discontent in France as well. Austrians are having one hell of a time. Meanwhile, I'm kind of revolt risk free. That's it, really. We're getting close to um, <laughs> having the no religion be prominent in my country. It's kind of crazy. <clears throat> kind of crazy, guys. Just kind of crazy. Did they go up here yet? Damn. Well, you know what? They're gonna set sail. I can't go there. There, go there. They're halfway to going to Alaska. Some of my other colonist up here. There it is. Also I have a colony in Africa. Just the very hostile in Africa. Sanghai. Ooh, they're only level six. We could kick their ass and there's gold mines. At least there's a gold mine there. Here's just a bunch of slaves. But there's a gold mine right there. Let's build an army here. I don't know, like three, four, five. Alright, let's conquer Songhai. Sure. The Un-Alaskan Islands declined. Hmm. 
have been fabricating claims. It's not like they'll attack me or anything, though. They're too scared to attack me. My ships aren't seagoing enough to, to cross. Not yet. Soon. Soon, everyone. Soon. But yeah, I'm gonna build an army here. I'm gonna conquer Songhai. I'll get a, uh, let's send this guy to Africa. Anything interesting in Africa? An alligator, or a crocodile, more rather. Another crocodile. Maybe conquer the Congo. They're Protestant, they're Congolese. They're Congolese Protestants. That's so weird. Build an army. Gotta build an army. Alright, what do we got here? David Vane. Who's this guy? Ikwatsin Tomak Ikwatsitilin? Or something? <laughs> Aztec guy. Can only assume. This agent has been expelled and sent home. Oh yeah, like that'll stop me from sending him back. Oh, the Inca no longer exists. Uh, not quite. Almost. All right, what did I get? Administrative tech. Yes. Like edges. So I got new government types that I can't use. Ooh. Other than that, did I get anything? Maybe some, some stupid shit. to build more earthen ramparts, especially in the colonies. I like how the French have 65,000 men here in the New World. They brought their entire army to fight against me and then just got stuck here. I wonder what happened to their navy. Or if they're fighting somebody. Am I out of military points? Shut. Actually, you know what? That's probably fine. Temple is what? Administrative? Dock? Is diplomatic tech? Quito? There's not too many places I haven't built a dock. There you go. That's probably it. Let's just colonize Alaska. I'll end up colonizing that entire coast anyway, so. Oh no. Yeah, they have to be at war with England right now. England's getting the crap kicked out of it. England's being conquered by Scotland. Scotland is allied with Wales. So not only are the English fighting the 100 years war, or not the 100 years war, they're fighting the, uh, they're fighting the civil war, but they're also fighting Scotland and France all at the same time. Good luck to England. Wow, Ireland's actually been formed under a noble republic. Hmm...
Do do do. So this will probably be a longer one. This will be a longer episode just because we haven't been doing much. And uh, I kind of want to start this war with these guys, the Songhai. They have the Falling Vassal, Mali, these guys. And they're just as weak. So let's declare war. I don't need a real reason. The Ottomans are a defender of the Sunni faith and will protect them. They're all the way over there. I'm going to declare war anyway, see what happens. The Ottomans didn't seem to care at all. Nope. Ottomans didn't care, so I'm going to conquer quite a bit of Africa now. Oh look, a big army. Let's stay the chill out here then. They're going to come to me. Five thousand men and a uh, couple cannons probably killed a lot of them. Wish I could send my actual army army. Can you imagine just the black flag of the pirates? down the coasts of America. Yarrr. There's actually quite a lot to colonize and I remember there being. Hooray, there's no religion wherever I just sent them. Go there. Spread the no religion. <laughs> They're gonna come and attack me. They are gonna come and attack me. Five thousand pirates and their guns. Oh, they decided against it. They're gonna walk away. They decided against it, everyone. <laughs> they just they walked away. Like we'll fight you somewhere else. I'm gonna let them land there. I'm also going to create the Pirate West African Charter here. Just because, um, yeah, why not? Looks like Portugal has a West African Charter, too. What if I were to colonize Madagascar? Is there anywhere that's got like, what's the uh, show province, the output? 52, it's got a five tax base, it's kind of crazy. Maybe move my thing to the new world and make all these colonies, perhaps. Oh look, I can actually see most of Newfoundland. So they own most of Canada, oh shit, Vinland. The Danes fucking created Vinland. That's pretty crazy. Governor Rolf Koss. Meanwhile, Florida, or the Spanish and the French, colonized uh, doubly so. Let's just kill all these guys. Let's see if we can kill them all. They're like way low, low uh, tech than me. So I should be able just to kill all of them. But they're going to try and run. And we're going to massacre them. Man, they kicked my ass. Maybe it's because they have like a billion soldiers. Oh no. These damn natives. <laughs> they done did killed me. Hmm. Well, that means I'm gonna have to make a mess a massive fleet. 
and send it over and take this army with it. So I need 25. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, there you go, I'll do 21 for now, and then uh, move the fleet, or move the army here, we'll land, wow, they unseaged it, we'll kill them all, and uh, continue with my life, oh, the Spanish are heading up the California coast, that's scary, I don't like that, I don't like that one bit. They saw me expand, that's why, obviously. They were like, well, we can't have that. So now I have all of Alaska, kind of, pretty much all of Alaska colonized. I don't think there are even any, like, good things up here. Hmm. England's still Catholic, which is surprising as hell. Oh my god, look, all of northern India is Muslim. That's crazy, I've never seen that happen before. And they declared a holy war on Morocco and the Spanish. They're not done, they're just kicking this shit out of Morocco. These guys are embody. They've also added Coptic as a religion, because I'm almost certain that's not a uh, any of the mods I have. Why are you still Zapotec? Fuck that. Do do do. What's the culture map mode look like? Aztec, Sapotec, Mayans, lots of pirates, Incans, Cosmopolitans, lots of pirate up north, some Zapotec, more pirate than Zapotec, or I could just take this army, let's do that, I think it's all, nope, let's just rally the navies here then, instead let's take this army in the capital. Uh, a golden figurehead sounds nice. Uh, just get a Karak. I really don't need. Or a Caravel. I really don't need Karak. Send the fleet over here. The massive pirate fleet. We'll, uh, we'll kill. Everything. Han Hans the first of Austria is now the Holy Roman Emperor. Who the fuck is Hans? Hans the first. King Hans the first von Habsburg. For some reason, um, Thal. What are these guys? Pueblo peasants. Let's take this army. And let's march all the way up here and kill them. So that my colony doesn't, or my vassal protector, whatever the hell it is, doesn't get murdered immediately. Alright, let's. Good, the entire army's been loaded on. You'll set sail for here. Hopefully they'll reach here before they've conquered everything. Oh look, the fucking Spanish have galleons. Man. Yeah, we were like we we're like three techs behind everyone. More than three, I'm like five techs behind everyone. More combat with, more artillery fire. Sixteen is definitely a uh, a big one. 
We get what do we get? We get the chamber demi cannon. These guys already have the le le uh, leather cannons. Blah, blah, blah. All right, what's the tech techs of Europe? Or this is good news. Wow, the Russians have better tech than I do. They're tech 19. These guys are tech 19. They're at 18. They're at 18. Scotland's at 18. <laughs> Jesus. Everyone's kicking my ass tech wide. Or tech wise. Where else is my navy? There they are. Hopefully the Ivory Coast can hold out. Come on, pirate fleet. Oh. There it is. They've landed. Oh, it's a slaughter. It's a slaughter. We win. The pirate king himself has led us here. Alright, let's heal. They're running. They know they can't fight us. The Pirate King himself. Oh, it's a massacre. Maybe I'll make them my protectorate after annexing this. I'm going to chase them all the way to Gao. Let's see. Gao is in the desert. Why would you have your capital in the middle of the desert? Well, they got caught. They got caught by natives. A perfect chance for Louis Balthazar to kill. Dead. The end of the English over Alexander Cavendish and his parliamentarians. Wait, the royalists have won? Oh no, 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 okay. I thought it said the royalists have won. I was like, that's crazy. Dip, dip power. Oh, good. We'll keep converting people. We're actually almost out of provinces to convert. They're trying to reinforce. Let's just kill them. Kill them good. Kill them good. Killing them real good. And they were defeated. Good good job, men. They're they're gonna run. Let's hurry up and siege all of their country. Oh look, a big army kind of. They keep rallying. Just wait, siege their uh, this province here, and then I'll go and kill their armies. Some more. Do they not have enough provinces to make it Castilian Brazil? They only need four or five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, it's not cord. Yes, that's right. They need to be cord. Oh, good. 
Good. We've <laughs> we've taken what we need to take. All right. I want that one. And your protectorate. No. Give me all your money then. I can actually do that. Let's do it. Ha ha! Yar har, lads. Crush the military here. New the new pirate west trade company thing. Let's get some new ships. Yes. Ooh, what do I get next? Oh yes, I get the galleon. And we get the early frigate next. Awesome. Alright, let's split the army. Take the king back to the new world where he belongs. I'll leave 9,000 men here to guard. Oh yeah, let's do that. Everybody will like me by 60. That improved, I guess. That improved a lot. Look at that. Holy crap. They're neutral. The Habsburgs are actually willing to trust me. Crazy. Well, I think I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. It helps me out, and I appreciate it. So, until next time, guys, stay tuned.